As we continue to worship God, Nancy Whittle is going to come forward and share with us one of the ways that we are seeking to be God's hands, God's feet, and God's voice in this community. Good morning, everybody. I'm Nancy Whittle, and I facilitate the Racial Justice Action Team here at Washington Street. Um, the country has been devastated by the mass, the recent mass shootings in Buffalo, New York, Laguna Woods, California, and Uvalde, Texas, just last week. We ask, as Becky and Austin did in their prayers, to keep the families and friends of those who lost loved ones in the recent shootings. We also pray for each other, our church, our community, and our nation to give us the courage to seek ways to stop gun violence. After the Buffalo shooting, I received an email from a church member. He expressed similar feelings to mine, outrage, disgust, and deep sadness that these shootings continue with little or nothing being done to prevent them except talk. He asked that the Racial Justice Action Team address the issue of gun violence and safety. So with that in mind, we wanted to share several opportunities with you today that you might want to participate in coming up in the next two weeks. June 3rd through June 5th, which is next Friday, Saturday, and Sunday, is National Gun Violence Awareness Day and Wear Orange Weekend. Wear Orange has become a national movement, and you can learn more about its origins in this week's connection, which I hope you picked up. It's, it's the first article on the front page. On June 4th, Saturday, next Saturday, June 4th, there's a Let's Pray Together South Carolina rally at the State House from 1 to 4. And it's part of, uh, it's an event that's part of the Wear Orange movement. So we encourage you all to wear orange next weekend and hope to see lots of orange in the, in the church next week. One other opportunity that I just found out about this morning is on Sunday, June, Saturday, excuse me, Saturday, June 11th from 12 to 2 at the State House. It's March for Our Lives rally, and it's in response to the shootings in Texas. We have several church members who plan to be at the church at 11.15 in the parking lot next Saturday, or Sunday, excuse me, Saturday, June 11th. And if you want to come, they're going to walk from the church to the State House and carry the church banner. So I encourage you to do that. That's Saturday, June 11th. And be it, if you're interested, be at the church at 1115. We know that gun violence is a very complex issue. There are different views and different sides. But somehow, somehow, we have to come together and do something about it. And I think if churches can't stand up now and begin to speak out and try to pull people together to do something about it, we need to move forward with that. If anyone has any suggestions about what the Racial Justice Action Team or the congregation can do to prevent gun violence, please contact me. I would love to hear from you as we move forward with this endeavor. Thank you so much.